All right, questions for Zakai? How has camp differed this year compared to last from your viewpoint? Uh, my viewpoint, uh, I think everybody is buying into what Coach Navarro and, you know, Coach Fuller uh, and Coach Atkins, what, what they're doing and Coach Storms uh, this year. Uh, I think the, the weight room program is uh, unbelievable. And, you know, coming out here for fall camp, I think this is this is the year. How big was the end of last season for you personally to, to have some success you know, stacked on top of each other games in a row, playing carrying that into the offseason? Uh, you know, the last couple games really uh, was a, a eye opener for me. You know, being able to be put in them positions that Coach Novell put me in, and uh, to make plays to show that I could showcase my uh, talents on the field. So uh, going into this uh, off season, yeah, I still build into that, and I still want to improve on, you know, my routes, my catching the ball at the highest point. You know, doing things like that to make me better each and every day. All right, we got Dennis Briggs on this other side. The additions at wide receiver, how much has it helped that room just come along? You guys see different looks, different body types in that room too. Oh yeah, uh, you know the new addition, adding uh, you know Johnny, Mike, you know all them guys, Deuce. Uh, who, who else I'm forgetting? I know I'm forgetting Winston, my boy Winston. Uh, all them guys, you know they bring they bring something new from wherever they came from. They they always bring something new. And so they they teaching all the guys that been here something new. So that's what I like about them guys. Last year you obviously bounced back and forth a little bit position wise. How nice has it been for you to be a little more concentrated on just one? Oh, it feels it feels great. You know, wherever Coach Novell put me at, I'm I'm a ball. I'm a I'm a I'm a team player. I don't care where you put me at. I'm gonna uh, do whatever it takes. Have you seen differences from, from Jordan in the huddle, just confidence wise, the way he commands it this year as he comes in as the Oh uh, nah, you know Jordan. He's he's the more of a vocal leader. He's the 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 huncho, the head man. He's just like Coach Novell. I feel like in the huddle, you know, you know, if we are talking, he said, "Come on, guy, let's go." We all be quiet. So that that's what I like that he he got that he getting that that step and that that the step to be a leader. I know there's rules in place now that kind of limits the amount of full pad practices you can have. How important is it to take advantage of these and? Oh, to, yeah. These full, full padded practice. You know, we uh, we <laughs> we um, you know, we got to take advantage of it each and every day. You know, uh, these practices. You know, once you do these days, you know, you can't get that day back. So you know, each rep, make sure your rep is perfect. How important has the depth been for just? How did up and down the roster and the quality reps that you guys are getting in practice, and how have you kind of seen that all develop over your career? I know, uh, you know, these uh, first couple practices, you know, uh, the depth, you know, the depth been good. You know, everybody, you know, everybody team be getting reps, uh, showing that they, what they could do. So yeah. How's Deuce kind of taking that step from the spring to now? It seems like he's more comfortable, more confident. Yeah, Deuce. Oh uh, yeah, Deuce is more comfortable. Deuce showing that uh, he can make plays. Uh, you know, me and Deuce, you know, stay after. He asked me if I, if for uh, more questions, like if he, he if he stucks on something. I, you know, I always ask him for it to make sure he want to make sure he's right before he go out there on the field and mess up. So, yeah, shout out to Deuce. Thank you. Thank you.